Yo, what is up, bros? Back with some great Patriot War mod. We got a brutal Operation Sea Lion to throw down. Now that France has surrendered, Britain becomes our biggest enemy. Its presence will make it impossible for us to move east with ease. The Supreme Command orders you to cross the English Channel and eliminate the British once and for all. Remove the threats to the European continent. Let's go. 23 rounds for the three star, four generals. All right, so we got donuts with a couple subs there. We got a small fleet in the north. We'll probably go up here and try to take out Mountbatten. Um, and then we've got a decent fleet. Maybe a couple rounds of targeting their fleet with ours and then try to land. Bros, huge news coming out of the German high command. Steiner has been stripped of his medals. And now Hoth has him. Hoth will lead this invasion. So I've been looking at this for a while, trying to figure out where we're going to land. I think the easiest way would be to maybe block this off right here. Or maybe if these bros come in this way, we can block it out right here and get our land troops. I'm thinking this side is probably going to be the easiest to get landed. So I'm going to move all our land troops over to this side. I think that is going to be the way we're going to handle this. Round two. All right, we're going already. We're getting the hell out of here. Get us the hell out of here. Let's see, they're coming down, so we need something. Uh, we're going to need some of our forces to follow with us. Look, you're supposed to attack this Panzer IV. It's just sitting there waiting to be attacked. Bruh. Yeah, if we could just continue this line. Just something like something just like this. It's perfect. This right here will work. Round three and we're on our way. Couldn't have worked out any better. And now we got Hoth out. I guess I can put our artillery along the coast here. Alright, well next round we'll have all our generals off. Oof. Like, they're not even trying to take that dock. They don't even give a shit about it. Pretty ballsy there, guys. Pretty damn ballsy, to say the least. Round four. Shit, you know what? I think... I think they're on to us. I think we've been found out. I still think this works. I, I still think we got it. Like, this is perfect. We'll just land right in here. We'll take a little bit of damage, but certainly not as much as we were going to take. Trying to make it through the other spot. Like, this is going to... This is going to be considerably less damage. Round five. Now, kind of the only question I got is where to land. They're kind of just following our generals around. You know what? Shit. We could land here and just go up through here. That would be the safest route. How many rounds do we got? 23. Shit. That's too, uh, that's going to take too long. That is going to take too long, maybe. Should I say we do it anyways? I've already I've already kind of committed to the plan I had here. I feel like I have to go through with it now. Round number six. God, they are just following us everywhere we go. We could just keep playing this game, you know, and um... Because they're trying to follow us. We could just pull them off. We could pull them all off land and then land. I have to think about what I'm going to do here. All right, we got moved up. I decided to just move these guys north along the coast just in case uh, something bad happens and we need to land right away. Round seven. See, I'm thinking we just land over here. And then just go in. 
I mean, it's a it's a long end around, but it it keeps our generals pretty healthy. And not to mention, we get to wreck a lot of theirs at sea, trying to follow us. Playing musical generals here. Round eight, a sea lion like no other sea lion. A sea lion the likes of which has never been seen before. And I mean, we can punish them as we work along the coast. So by the time we get to the north, are they even going to have any crapper units left to oppose us? Dang, Runshed's kind of got left out there to dry, didn't he? Yeah, I think we, uh, this was a pretty, pretty clean. Like, look, my general's got most of their health. That would have never happened going across here. There would be some that was wrecked before they ever landed. Round nine. You know what? I could leave. We could kind of screw with them a little bit. We could take our Panthers north. And uh, leave some of our crappier units down here to battle it out. I think we could definitely do that. I think that would be huge PP move. Nobody would expect it. Yeah, we're just absolutely destroying their generals before they ever do any damage to us. So it's kind of like the Irish were like, look, we're kind of sick of the British as shit. Why don't you uh, hop over here and we'll uh, give you a nice little landing zone. We're going to pretend we're not going to actually help you. We're going to pretend like it was against our, our will. But yeah, come come on over. Come on over. They're going to bring their generals trying to do something. Donus is going to go in here and absolutely crush generals. I mean, general after general gets shit on before they ever do any damage. Round 11. There's never been such a smooth. Such a smooth operation, Sea Lion. The smoothest sea lion known to man right here. See, right across, no damage, no nothing. We'll guard the coast as we head north and just punish their generals. Now that they got that wall there, I can just bring everybody across. It's not a big deal now. Except Runestead. Well, if Runestead stay down there. Round number 12. Um, and we're off. See, check this out. You, nev you never knew I had such a smooth method of getting across here. Never occurred to you. My strategicals was this on point. Bros are having no generals left. Down with another one and down with another one right here. Of course, we did lose some territory here. We're having a little bit of a problem here. Round 13. All right, here we go. This is what we've been waiting for. Well, if you guys, if any one of you could hit worth a shit. Jesus. What has happened at the, it was perfect until my generals just decided they weren't going to do any damage anymore. Well, at least we're getting Hoth landed. We got 10. 
Look at where we're at, and we've got 10 rounds to finish this up. 14, and we just now got our first general landed. Probably... I don't know. It was fun, though. It was something different. I'll take a little bit different sea lion for some fun. Why not? Round 15. I mean, we should be able to clear shit out pretty quick. Like, this is not going to take that long. We can even send a couple bros a little bit further south. Yeah, once we get all these guys landed, it should go pretty quick. Uh, even though we don't have that many rounds to really get anything done, I think we might get close anyways. Just because we've wrecked so many other generals at sea. And our generals all have high health. Round 16. Slim Shady's coming in. Got Lieb hitting Wingate. Yeah, this is good. It took a little bit longer, obviously, but it felt right. All right, so we get our first true test of what a Hoth can do with the medals. Let's take a look at Slim Shady's health. Yeah, you could one-shot him easy, bro. Just do it. Yeah, see, it wasn't, a, wasn't even a problem. Go down here, open up a couple cities. Or just one. That's all right, too. Round 17, we got back uh, all our territory. Which is nice. All right, Hoth. I'm going to not... Damn, they still have quite a few generals, don't they? Go ahead and open up this and open up leads. Damn, Hoth just, he's almost there. He's just this, this far away from being a complete badass. But luckily for him, um, he doesn't need to be a complete badass. Because he got his bros backing him up. He doesn't have to do it all himself. We got six rounds. Was it 23? Yeah, we got six rounds. Round 18. All right, let's get the hell out of here, guys. Hoth. We need Hoth to hit every single one shot on non generals. We can't have him missing. I keep forgetting Rommel got put on a shitty ass tank. Yeah, he's gonna get. We'll just go ahead and block him. All right, Munstein. Yeah, ain't done. I can't even remember mentioning Munstein's name. What the hell has Munstein even been up to? We used to only talk about Monstein. Everything was Monstein, and now, I mean, nobody even cares. When you got Hoth and you got Steiner. Round 19. I mean, if we are going to get this done on time, we are going to have to bypass generals. And I think because the, because of the uniqueness of the way we launched, our sea lion, I think it's cool to just avoid some of these generals and just go for the three star if it is even possible, which I'm not convinced it is. But we're going to give it our best shot here. We are going to damn sure try. Round 20. Oh, look at this. We are going to have to send a Steiner up there. Monty thought he'd play some uh, some games with us and lose. 
All right, so I got you back up now, bro. Hoth is a is a one man wrecking crew right here. Hoth, Hoth's only job is to open and move, open and move. And he better start opening and moving a little bit quicker. Round twenty one. We're not going to be able to do it. We, uh, we got close. I mean, when we got landed and, uh, 10 rounds were already up, you, you knew it was going to be pretty damn close. Wow, good hit. Round 22. Can you go ahead and open this for us? Thank you. We just didn't have enough time. And Hoth is coming on strong right here at the end. I mean, is there still a chance? There might still be a chance here. We're going to have to have a decent amount of money, though. Right at the end. To be able to open the docks. That's the one thing that might be a pain in the ass. There's going to be these cities they want. We're going to throw some generals down on those. God, everybody is just pathetic. So disappointed in every general except for Hoth. Round 23, the last round we've got to do this in. So we can take that pretty easy. God, I wish uh, Hoth had some better movement. We got that one easy enough. We don't have enough money to open all this shit up, though, do we? I don't think we do. Because right now, we need to open this up. We need to open this up, and then we got two cities in the north that we never opened. I should have left... I should have left Steiner up there. If we can open this with generals, that will, bro, that will save us money. I haven't got, I mean, yeah, it ain't going to save us too much money because nobody seems to want to put it, put in the work here. So no three star. We grabbed the docks in the south. We couldn't get this bro down and we still got two cities in the north. Round 24. A sad round. A round where we, um... We've admitted defeat. Could not pull out the three star. Pretty damn depressing. Well, let's go ahead real quick and open this. And then get Monstein. Somebody has to deal with Wingate. Send Rommel over here. And uh, Guderian, where do you want to go up here, I guess? Hold that. You know, I forgot how weak bombing is against cities. We weren't even able to open that one up. If I had remembered that, we might have been able to clear this in a three star because I'd have left some tanks up there to open those cities. Because we didn't really need them down here that much. 
Round 25. I need the movement that the uh, the Great Vision mod had. Remember, I could go from here to all the way up here in one move. That mod was nuts. Alright, there's that. We, um... Put down a sub there. I'm going tier 2 because I don't want to lose these while I'm working up here in the north on shit. See if we can't uh, get this general down here. All right, another general cleared. Munstein can't even take that bro out at all. Round twenty six. All right, this could. I'm thinking this is the round. I'm think. Oh, bro, come on! You still can't reach a city. So we can open up that one, no problem. Uh, yeah, we might be able to do this right here. Uh, our crapper units were able to open that and get the health on this down far enough. We should be able to wrap it up here. Three rounds after what I wanted to, but it was a very unique sea lion. I mean, I think we still made pretty good headway considering what round it was when we actually landed in the UK. And I still think if I would have went ahead and pushed a general up here and taken these that we probably would have gotten the three star. I just forgot how shitty bombing was on land targets. That's the only problem. All right, bros. I'm kind of disappointed, but that was a good one. If you are enjoying this content, you know what to do. Slap like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will be back here for our next upload. Peace, Brumanati out.